You feel it fill a little bit? Yep. Okay, so when you're ready. It's in. Oh, shit. That went through everything. That went like into the back of my throat. Oh my God. That was so good. Oh, that felt so good. Oh. Got it. Got it on the first try. Oh my God, it went through. Good. So oh my God. It was worth working it. <sighs> it went all the way through. Yeah. Wow. Oh, thank God it did on the first one. Yeah. It was worth working it Yeah. It went all the way through. Yeah. Oh, that felt so good. Get your floor yeah. So we have Katie back. This is our second cranial facial release. If you haven't seen her first video, you need to check it out. I left the uh, link in the description box, but it got so many views so fast because Katie's experience is off the chart. What, what was your original problem? I mean, if you've seen the first video, probably. Uh, you'll know, but if you haven't, let's recap, okay? So, I broke my nose cheerleading about 20 years ago. The girl shifted my nose over and I hadn't been able to breathe through the left side of my nostril at all in over 20 years. Like 100% blocked. Completely blocked. So, I came to you for the treatment. Um, it took four attempts to get the balloon in the maybe, nostril. Maybe five, I don't know. People <laughs> um, counted though, it was yeah, four or five. Yeah. Um, yeah. Definitely was not easy. No, I, totally I can't even believe it. that you just kept with it too. I think that's what people connected to the most was that she just kept trying. She's like, do it again, do it again. Yeah. You know? Well, because I wanted it done. Yeah. And if you were confident that you were going to be able to, to really try, then let's absolutely do it. And um, totally noticed the difference. As soon as it went in, it was a really bizarre feeling because it's been stuck. Um, my nose bled a little bit. Um, I would say for maybe like 10 hours or so later, um, anytime I blew my nose, there was a little bit of blood. And then I wanna say 24 to 48 hours later, I was able to breathe through my nose slightly. I mean, it wasn't perfect, but I haven't been able to do that in years. And it was so exciting. All right, and you said it's about 20% there. Yeah. And that's why this is a process. It's not, for many people, it'll be, you know, a more of a process than a one-time procedure. Mm -hmm. um, the, the guy that taught me how to do this is named Dr. Adam Del Torto. Um, he was a doctor that, that was my mentor. Uh, he did this for 25 years before he retired this year. He just retired. And he said the average that he worked with people is about four times. Mm -hmm. However, with uh, really bad face pain, there's a condition called trigeminal neuralgia. Mm. He had a lot of success with that, but he said that would often take 14 to 25 treatments. Wow. But he helped almost every single one of those That's cases. That's amazing. So let's say someone's had chronic, horrible face pain for like 10 years mm -hmm. and it takes 20 treatments, it still would be better to know that something could possibly work. Absolutely. Then nothing's working, you just have to suffer the rest of your life. So he warned me that about that. I talked to him on the phone actually since you last been here. She did hers three weeks ago. Um, and so we should have probably seen you sooner, but right. you were busy. I was out of town. So this is the first time we ever got back together and we're going to do it today. And actually, you're going to come back in two more days, I think. Mm -hmm. Let's say Friday, Saturday, Sunday. So yeah, in yep. two days and do a third one. So, so excited. So at least you're going to have a couple close together. And we'll see. I'm, I'm committed to help her and she's committed to be on this journey to hopefully mm -hmm. get 80, 90, 100% back on the left side. It's so, so exciting to you know, breathe through your nose. It's, it, I haven't done it, it in so It changes long. your sleep, it changes your ability to relax, it changes your ability to work out too. Yeah. So, so let's see what happens. So the first thing we're gonna do, I think we should start with um, a neck adjustment. So we're gonna do it a different order today. Perfect. Okay, so you're gonna lie on your back. And if it's okay, can we do the Y strap? Yes, 100%. Okay, good. I love that thing. All right, it's good stuff, right? It's amazing. I love all of this. All right, good, good, good. <clears throat> all right, so the Y straps here. And just pass it on your head. And so what we're going to do is we're going to do a light adjustment. Well, not, there's nothing light about the Y strap, but <laughs> meaning we're going to spend 
we're, since you're coming back in two days, we're gonna and we'll do a full body one mm -hmm. on Sunday. But um, we're gonna do wise chap, some neck, some upper back, mm -hmm. and then we'll go right into cranial facial release. It's not gonna be a thirty minute video. I don't think. Famous last words. <laughs> So we're going to set this up and just get the stretch going a little bit. Mm -hmm. So big breath in and blow it out. Wow, that was great. Where'd you feel that? Everywhere. I'm really mostly my upper neck, but it, you feel the stretch all the way down your spine. It's incredible. Awesome. It's so good. So now I'm going to do a little more release in here, okay? Mm -hmm. Oh, that felt so good. <laughs> That was a good one. Ah. Uh. Ah, oh, so good. All right. And we'll <laughs> do the upper back next. So let's do this now. Yes. Me, when you're in a good spot, let me just get the neck thing ready. And we're going to start it on the right side again. Right, because that's what we did last time, which is the easier of the two sides. Right, which even the right side wasn't like quote unquote easy because you still hit a little bit of a a block. Right? Yeah, my nose is horrible. Right. Someone wants to give me a new one, I'll take that. This is floppy. Floppy is was my daughter. My daughter's twenty five now, so she donated floppy to work with us as a as a service dog. I think that this is what made everything so much better. It was floppy. Without floppy, it might not have happened. Right? <laughs> floppy gave me strength. So I'm just setting this up here. I'll be right there. So stick with, stick the camera with Katie just for a second. Yeah. Okay. Now there's different chambers that we're trying to hit. So this time, I did the middle chamber on the right. right. So this time I'm going to go higher. I'm going to do the upper chamber on the right. Okay. And we're still trying to shift things, you know? Mm-hmm. Now, believe it or not, working on the opposite side helps a little bit on the involved side. Not directly. It would be indirectly. But since it's moving some of the inner bones and their interconnection between them, uh, you'll get like a like a collateral movement on the difficult side as well. So that's why we still work on the right side um, because there's a lot of underlying misalignments in the whole system. Here we go. Mm -hmm. Much easier on that side. Oh yeah. It's already in. Mm-hmm. I'm going to fill it up a little bit, okay? Mm -hmm. You feel it fill a little bit? Yep. Okay, so when you're ready. It's in. Oh, shit. That went through everything. That went, like, into the back of my throat. Oh, my God. That was so good. That was better than the first time. Yeah, so, and you can see... Um, here's another one. Uh, yeah, tissues. yeah. Um, you could see um, how working on the. We know that the left side's the bad side. That's where it was fractured. That's where it collapsed over. Yeah. Um, but you could see that the right side does help out, right? Yeah. It yeah. helps the whole wow configuration out. That definitely went through way better than it did the first time. And it totally went through. I felt the balloon like all the way in the back. Like it cracked through the back, yeah, right? Yeah, yeah. Wow, that was great. And did it, um, did you hear any yeah. noises? Yeah, it's like, that, like a little crackling. But yeah, it's 100% that went right through. It was yeah. so much easier too. Fingers crossed, let's not do it four times on this side. No, let's, <laughs> let's get it. One of the things that the balloon does is it mobilizes the cranial bones. It releases direct pressure on the brain by having your bones squeeze so tight in your face. It relieves the dural men meningeal, um, meningeal tension and the dura is like the sac or sheath on top of our brain and spinal cord. So it releases some of the pressure around that. 
and think of the casing on a hot dog being too tight. And we sometimes feel that way where, you know, like our brain and our skull is just too tight. Um, it definitely opens breathing passageways. It will facilitate sinus drainage. And some of the people that would come for something like this have breathing problems, migraine headaches, sinusitis, tinnitus, which is the sound in your ears, like the whooshing or ringing, vertigo, Bell's palsy, trigeminal neuralgia, sleep apnea, snoring, head trauma. And um, it helps a whole bunch of different things for people. But we don't really target, we don't really target curing any disease or ailment. I think I'm getting better at, well, we'll see, but did you see how quickly I got it in yeah. the right side? Yeah, yeah. Um, and the left side, it was tricky. It's, you know, I'm navigating, who knows, all around. Uh, <laughs> it's the cave exploring. The cave exploring, correct. <laughs> so we're gonna begin again, okay? Okay. Let's start again on that one. Much better. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I have it halfway in, but that's not enough. Or it'll pop out. Mm -hmm. I think that's it. Yeah, yeah, I yeah. yeah. Got it. Fucking A. I totally agree. Oh, got it. Man, that was tough. <sighs> Just doing a one shot if we can. Yeah. So, one of the keys is to fill it up a little first. Okay. Because it kind of sets it in. Right, right, right. I'm saying, right, like I know what the hell I'm talking about. You feel it fill up? Yeah. Okay, ready? Yeah. Got it. Got it on the first try. Oh my God, it went through. Oh, so oh my God. It's worth working it correctly. It went all the way through. Yeah. Wow. Oh, thank God it did on the first one. Yeah. It was worth making it correct. Yeah. It went all the way through. Yeah. Oh, that felt so good. Get your floor tissues. Yeah. Key to this treatment, don't wear makeup. Yeah. Oh, that felt so good. <laughs> Crazy crap, right? <laughs> oh, that felt so good. Yeah. It went through all the way. That was good. Good. Here, look up at me for a second. Let her collect herself. <laughs> so, I mean, 
And you can see I'm the same person doing the right side, and I'm the same person doing the left side. So the right side, I'm like, whoop, and I got the balloon in, no problem. The left side, every which way I tried to go in, it just hit a block, like a, like a wall, like, like it was rigid. Um, and again, we're trying to get that in and like lift and expand. And did you hear any crackling yes. last time? Yeah, 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 yeah. There was definitely cracks. It went all the way through. I felt it like in the back of my throat and everything. Yeah. It's, yeah. And it's pretty intense. Yeah. You know? The most intense thing is getting the balloon in there. Yeah. Well, that's the thing. I mean, it's, on, it's, especially yeah. for me, it's like, it's such a weird thing. You know, there's no spaces and you're trying to like finagle through. Yeah. But you did it. Congratulations. Uh, thank you. <laughs> uh, congratulations to you. So, um... But thanks for watching. We're going to do another one, part three. So this is number two, part three. We're going to shoot in two days. Mm -hmm. uh, and um, if you guys haven't seen my uh, other channel, I have an animal channel where I do animal chiropractic, where I work on horses, dogs, pigs, chickens, cows, goats, cats, cats and sheep. sheep. And uh, I'm ready to work on other animals too, if you have any you want to bring to me. All right. Thank you for watching today. Wait, keep coming. Uh, anything you want to say? Uh, that was great. <laughs> I'm so glad I went through a first try. All right, good, thanks. You can fill a little bit? Yep. Okay, so when you're ready. It's in. Oh, shit. That went through everything.